we got us a basic house. It's pretty nice. I like it. Uh, we could do this. Uh, let's go ahead and get the foundation. That's what we got around front anyway. So we'll make it match back here. Get in there. Not sure how I want to do that. Uh, I'll probably just continue that roof right on out. Tell you the truth. Be a nice little covered porch on both ends here. I hear that chicken. <laughs> That'll work for that. It's a little high pitched of a roof for this far south that we are, but I've never seen snow this far south, so but anyway. That's a quick little cabin. We could almost jump up on the roof. I like a cabin you can jump up on the roof. But uh yeah, let's load up. Let's see I got hundred and forty four arrows. Surely we can uh get a bunch of What do I need to make that? Rawhide three. Alright, so we gotta go hunting. A hunt and we will go. A hunt and we will go. Yeah, I don't want no little little badgers, man. I want some uh there's deer over here and buffalo. Buffalo are easier because you shoot at them and they'll chase you, so all you gotta do is just run from them and you get you get everything. Alright? Thwack. <laughs> See? You can just shoot them as you run. <laughs> But if you go shoot at a deer, you gotta chase the deer and shoot it. Whereas the buffalo will chase you and do that to you if you're not careful. <laughs> there we go. I think we got him on the run now. Thought we did. He'll be dying soon. <laughs> soon enough, hopefully. There we got him. <laughs> it takes a little bit. We got 11 rawhide out of that. So we can make up quite a bit of stuff. Uh, still got 123 arrows. So that took, what, 21 arrows? Uh, did all the other buffalo run off? I think everybody ran off. <laughs> Oh man, I was hoping to find another buffalo. There's a deer. <laughs> I missed it. Uh oh, now I'm stuck. Come on, get out of here. <laughs> Come on, horse. <laughs> Well, I'm missing it, ain't I? All right, we got him on the rocks now. <laughs> well, I was missing it. Yeah, I like blunting the buffalo better. As long as you don't run up against the rock or anything like that again. I think they're up here, right? Or there's usually some up here. Usually. Nope. <laughs> but uh, I guess while we're out, we could find a bunch of cotton. 
I'm not really interested in uh, cotton and whatnot. I'm more interested in uh, just getting some rawhide together. What's this? Looks like a bear spot up here. There it is. There it went. <laughs> this game still got some glitches, huh? But it's alright. Let's um see we got a few rawhide. Thirteen I think. We got two for the deer and eleven for the buffalo. I'd like to find another buffalo. Eleven rawhide ain't gonna be enough, I don't think. I'd probably make some shoes and a uh some pants. We could do that bear, but <laughs> see did we go up in this canyon or was it the other one? It's this one. Boy, it sure is getting hung on the rocks a bunch lately. Seems like they did something with the collision or maybe. I don't know. But anyway, um we got rawhides so we can craft our whatchamacallit thing. Our tannery. We'll get it, then we'll get some leather, then we can craft our sewing bench. But I think we can make I do believe we can make most all of our uh, yeah see our pants our fringe pants our shirt we need 15 rawhide for that we can make some <laughs> shoes uh, how much leather did we need for that Oh, we don't need no leather for that. We need leather for that. We just need one leather. So, let's make a leather. Then how much raw does that leave us with? Three. And we need 15 for that. 10 for that. 10 for a vest. 20 for a jacket. Some gloves and all that stuff. So, I guess we're going to go back hunting. But uh, we can put some boots on. It's always a good thing. And we can make that and put it in the house. And while we're out here, we can put our well out. Oh, uh, where's a good spot for a well? And uh, what do we got? Yeah, we got stuff to do that. We need to make uh whatchamacallit a canteen. I think we can do it with just uh iron ore. Uh where are you, canteen? We down here. Make a canteen. Let's make a mailbox. Uh let's get a stove going. Not only that, let's get some. <laughs> yep, we need some tools going. Um, uh oh. Oh. Now I can make it. I was too fooled up. Yeah, we'll get all our tools made up. And up. Pretty much the start. This <laughs> is what you get it out of, you know. I mean, we've made our start. We got our horse. We got everything. We're getting clothes made. Well, we still got to do some hunting. But uh, I tell you a trick. Here, back in inventory. Uh, we can auto stack and sort. And, well, we need a bunch more stone. Because it takes one stone and one. But I think. You can only sell them for 10 cents a piece now. But even so, how much is a outfit now? I mean, in the stores. They kind of adjusted inflation, adjusted the prices with the... So, 
where you used to get a dollar for the arrows now I think you get 10 cents for them but it's still not too bad of a deal because I mean because <laughs> the shirts and everything still doesn't cost that much so being that it don't cost that much you don't need to make that much Uh, we could put a little stove in right over yonder here. Have this little kitchen way here. That way we can cook some of this meat real quick. Uh, oh no. What do I got? I got raw deer meat and raw bison meat. Is there anything I can cook with that? Huh. Surely you can just cook regular junk in there. Huh. No? <laughs> Man, you gotta actually have all the stuff. Well, what if you don't have all the stuff and you're hungry? That's fine, I guess. Uh, what do I got? Bison? So you can't just cook bison? Oh, man. I mean, that's all cool and everything if you if you got everything. But what if you don't have everything and you're hungry? Uh-oh, there is a bear out there. I do hear it. Let's go find it. Hey, where are you at? Did he just die? Yep. <laughs> Didn't even want to fight it out, did he? He said, ain't no use in it. Kiwanu was home. <laughs> yeah, smart bear. But, uh, oh, yeah, I dropped this stuff. What was that I dropped? All that stuff. Right on. I forgot. Now it, uh, leaves you a loot bag if you drop anything so now we got raw bear meat and bear pelt and more raw hide just seven but uh that was awful nice just to walk up and sacrifice himself like that for us let us fill up with water get a drink I reckon we could go ahead and munch a little something. And then we need to go get more buffalo. They give us the most, really. Uh, we ain't got to get buffalo. We shoot anything we want. <laughs> There's no hunting seasons here. Hey man, hey, there's some cotton in case I want to make a a white man shirt and some aloe vera. Hey, check that out. It's nice to find it when you're not building a fence. <laughs> if you ever build a fence, that aloe vera man, it'll give you fits. You come along, the fence will quit working. Like, why ain't the fence going down? Like, something's in the way. You look all around, and you'll find them aloe vera plants that are just totally hard to see anyway. There's some buffalo down here. Used to be. I don't know anymore. See, like, everything is different. Hey, there's some bandits over there, too. We could just stir them right on up. And I can't even hit that deer. Hey, we're getting it. <laughs> Get up on its tail end here. Then we'll do some shooting. <laughs> Alright, we're getting... We're getting stuff... 
We'll have us a snoo suit here in a minute, for sure. Still got a hundred arrows. Well, there used to be buffalo that roamed in this parts. I guess you gotta find everything again. I got that one, huh? <laughs> that will work for me. Three more rail hides. So what do we got? Uh, we needed. We've almost got enough to make the pants. <laughs> we need 30 or 40 rail hides. We need a bunch to make us a whole suit there's them buffaloes Let's see if we can get one to follow us for a minute here <laughs> hey buddy put a couple in his eyeball right there put a couple in that eyeball over here oh he's still following us <laughs> this guy's pretty tough I knew I was going to run into something sooner or later. Looked like we had him on the stumble there. And we're up against another rock. Let's pick a nice open place to run from him here. Well, I don't know which way he's going. Now I jumped off my damn horse. <laughs> Oh man, if I lose him, I done lost him, didn't I? Sure did, he ran off and so I just wasted all them arrows on that. Unless he went this way. Is that him? About to die? Yep. <laughs> Good deal. Sometimes if you let them out of your sight, they'll like de on you. No matter how much you're shooting at them and whatnot. Hey, we got another one on us. It's two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, <laughs> nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 14, 15, oh, we hit that rock anyway, didn't we? Oh, boy, we better get out of there. How much was that, 14? Did we kill him? Oh, there he is. Uh. They glitched out and disappeared on me, didn't they? We still got some glitches in the game here. Right, let's see what we got. We got 45. I think that'll do us to get started on here. We can definitely make us a suit. Um, should be able to dye some things too. I'm not sure how or if they have implemented it just yet. Woohoo! <laughs> totally just ramped my horse. I'm in the wrong holler, ain't I? Nope, I'm in the right one. <laughs> I'm getting lost. I don't even know where I live. Let's park the horse in back in case another bear shows up again. But. Now we can make some pants, we can make a shirt, I don't care so much about a vest, but uh, looks like we need five more rawhide to make a pair of gloves, and three more pelts to make a hat, 
That's alright. At least we get some pants and stuff on. <laughs> That's all that matters, right? A nice shirt. And we'll have a nice jacket if we need one. If we end up going up north. It could at least make a match though. But I don't care. It's fine. <laughs> Looks a little hot though. 102 degrees with the shirt on. There we go. We'll be the wild man running around with. Okay. So what else was I doing? Uh. We need to build a campfire. I guess we can't cook on that one thing. I mean, yeah, we'll just build a simple campfire or you want a large campfire? We'll do a large one. And surely I'll be able to cook that meat on there with no problems. Surely. But we'll see. But I want to cook that meat. I do believe it. Yeah, it spoils. I ought to smoke it. What do I need to build a smoker real quick? Brick. Planks. Um, yep. Campfire medium. Cooks it a little faster. That one cooks a little fast. I didn't know we had a medium. That's cool. Learn some every day. But uh, where do we want to put this thing at here? Yeah, we just stick it right here. That'll be fine. <laughs> we'll put us some wood in there. Ignite it up. We'll throw some meat in yonder there. Is that all of it? Oh, we got some bear meat too. And that is all of it though, right? This auto stack sort. Uh, we got wood. We need planks and whatnot. I didn't make a table saw. So I put it out, didn't I? I didn't put it out. And we need to put out our mailbox. Just in case anybody wants to mail something. <laughs> and I reckon, um... We'll come up here. Put out our table saw. And tell it to craft all the planks at once, which will be 40. And we'll jump out the back of our unfinished house and <laughs> check on our food. And uh, yeah, that's surviving. But, uh, what do we need to do next after that? We got tools making. Uh, see, I'm not caring too much about the... I'll run around in the buckskins. They're fine. Uh, gunsmithing, whatnot. Do I want to hunt bandits or I want to farm? What do I want to do? That's something we'll have to decide. Um, yeah, I might try my hand at farming. Who knows? <laughs> We're not in a good place for farming, though. But uh, coming up out of this hill, though, there's a lot of good farmland around. We could actually... Let's ride down yonder way and take a look here. This could be our remote cabin. Let's look on the map here. Uh, yeah, I think that remote cabin is up in 1215. Hello, little badger. But right down here, I mean... Yeah, I think we'll destroy that cabin and move. Because I think I want a ranch. I think I want my ranch down there. Uh, there's some bad feathers right there.
Oh man, I'm all hung up in the rock. <laughs> uh oh. Better get out of there before I get stuck for good, huh? I don't know if I can get back out of there. Yeah. Yeah, I'm you. Right, here we go. <laughs> That's dangerous. But anyway. Let's see if I get stuck here. I think turning this valley here into a nice ranch. Well, be careful on them rocks. Yeah, that's a bad deal. Yeah, I think that'd be alright. Nice little sweeping valley. Uh, cause I told Hannah I was thinking about building back down here by Alma, where Alma used to be. Which was right in front of us here and across the river. But yeah, this little valley right here would be nice, won't it? We'll put us a house right up there or something. We'll have us a barn up there on that little plateau. And all this will be our range. I believe that'll all be within this 1315 square here. I like to give everybody their own square, you know. Heck, you can have a couple if you want. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, the only rules here is, uh, don't build on somebody else's square and don't be trying to exploit everything, building into rocks, hiding your, all your stuff and everything. But, uh, yeah, I think right up here, be a nice place for a house and yeah we're still in 1315 there's some wolves or at least one there uh, we'll get us a pelt maybe if we can hit it you better hit it it's gonna hit you <laughs> Come on, he's going to chase me right back to his buddies here, ain't he? I just ain't skilled with this bow anymore, am I? I ain't had to shoot that in a long time. Alright, we got enough pelts, we can make us a hat. But, um... Oh yeah, there's a lot of horses right here. But yep, yeah, right here will be the house. That's still in the, yeah, it's right on the border. We'll build a house overlooking the valley. And uh, yeah, we'll fence it off too. I love running the fence right down the line. <laughs> you can do it like a, uh, let's see, uh, put the map on. Then you can run just like that, right up to the line. <laughs> then when you get to the line, you can just take off down it. Let's see, right when you get in the middle of it there, you line up across it. It should be middle way right there. And once you get lined up like that, you can click the map off. And if you run straight down it, you'll run straight down that line. Or if you line it up straight west that's how I run my fences I'll run them and watch the map till I get down there to the other borderline turn and go the other way but anyway that's our plan <laughs> and uh, we got a wide open map and everything to do it with so uh, and we're not using any admin on this one. <laughs> All my other videos, I ain't gonna lie to you, it's using admin controls to summon everything. I didn't spend all that time working to build them buildings. <laughs> but I was doing it for the greater community. But anyway, this was gonna be a survival for a, a definite uh, 
what do you will call it? <laughs> the all natural way. But yeah, we're gonna have a nice. We'll put some barns down there, a little stockade, some bunk houses over there, maybe. We'll put us a nice ranch, but uh, what I'm trying to get at is we're gonna work for it this time. But uh, like, subscribe, stay tuned, hit the bell for notifications, and uh, we'll be back with more of this.